Have you heard of a little something called the Guinness Book of World Records? Well, it was made by a beer brewery. And I'm going to talk to you about how you make beer and a tour that I went on at the Guinness Brewery. The ingredients to make beer are water, which makes up only well, like 90% of beer, malted grain, I can't believe I forgot what malted means, then there's yeast and a plant called hops, which are basically, they look like artichokes. The first step in making beer is to get a bunch of grains, mill them down, and then mix them twice. Then you put in the hops and mix it again, and then there goes more mixing. And then you heat it up, then cool it down, and then it goes through a fermentation process, and then it can officially be called beer. But then there's some extra steps that people can take to, like, basically experiment with beer. After the fermentation and experimenting and whatnot, it's put in barrels to bring the flavor of whatever was in the barrels last into the actual beer before it is actually served in a bar or restaurant or whatever. The first part of the tour I went on, this somebody was just outside explaining how the Guinness Brewery was founded. Apparently somebody signed a 9,000 9, year lease, 45 pounds every single year. It, it, it's weird. You're not going to be living to see those 9,000 years. And there was also this story about an Irish company who wanted to use the Guinness heart, harp sim symbol in their logo. So they just decided to take the harp and then flip it around. I don't know if they got sued or not, but that's just a weird story. Then the tour guide showed us the ingredients. Water water and malted grains, hops, and yeast. I ate one of the malted grains. It, 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 it was really, really bitter. Like, like ex extremely bitter. It, it, it basically tasted horrible. Anyway, he explained about the ingredients. Then he took us into the actual factory. We saw how beer was made, and there was also a bunch of like gigantic silo-looking things where they act where they make the beer. Then he took us around, and there was oh yeah, he explained about the barrels. I did not pay attention to that, so then I asked the guy after the tour, and he answered it again. I just have real. I don't. I have. I got a problem with like paying attention to conference lecture style things. After all, after the tour was done, everybody went upstairs to drink a bunch of rounds of beer. My, me and my dad did not do that. First of all, I am underage. My dad just didn't drink any beer. What water is better? What water is better? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, smash that like button, subscribe, and turn on post notifications.